Well, Project Assassin was a film that Rob Hill had made with his two friends, Andy and Mike Hurst. And I was at college at the time, and that, I think they were, I mean, I think they were in sixth form. Me, you know, they weren't. They were they were two years younger than me, and um, and they kind of they were such entrepreneurs that I was roundly used and abused, and kind of they got me to borrow equipment from college so that they could shoot their film. And their film took three or four years to shoot, and they shot it once and on like SVHS, and they reshot it again on Beatrice P. And it was you know it's a ma uh, climbed a massive mountain with no support, no money. Everyone was on the dole. It, it wasn't. There was no like kind of rich dad just doling out cash to pay for it. It was all totally scrabbled together. And that was my first experience of filmmaking. But seeing that drive, you know, that all, all three of them were just totally, um, dri totally driven, and um, and they made the film and they finished it. And that's where I came in contact with Andy Stark as well, who's my producer to to this day. You know, and I met Andy in Brighton like 20 odd years ago, and he was involved in it as well. And it and they made it, and then they took it to Cannes. Like completely naively, just turned up in Cannes and and went to parties and 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 there had been, I guess Rob was probably about twenty or something like that, and just went into a bar and talked to people and eventually they got a distribution deal for it and Andy and Rob and Mike went off to Hollywood after that to 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 make other movies and do other deals and that I, and that was just just blew my mind that you could actually, if you just had the balls to do it, you could do anything you know and they they had none no connection to the industry at all none of them.